My passion and major impetus that brought me to HSS was my training of search and rescue dogs, which I've been doing for more than 15 years now. And um, I was not really ready to give it up. She came because she had a challenging problem with her ankle. She'd had uh, multiple ankle injuries over the years. I developed instability in the ankle and over time, a lot of pain in the ankle. And it had gotten to the point where it, where it was interfering with her um, quality of life, her ability to work. Back home, they were offering her an ankle fusion surgery, which is certainly uh, an option. She wanted to pursue other options, so she, she came to us to talk about uh, ankle replacement. For about a year before I had the surgery, I was actually in the woods with crutches. We discussed all options on the table, non-surgical options, the ankle fusion option, and also doing an ankle replacement. I wanted to be able to walk in the woods. I mean, we walk in terrain that's very uneven. There's nothing stable about it. And, and um, we're walking through the mud, we're hiking in water. And so in that case, in patients who have ankle arthritis where they are going to walk on uneven ground, we want to preserve the motion at the joint. So an ankle replacement uh, is going to be the best option. We were out training last weekend and walking up and down hill, up hills and down in ditches. and. I don't think about it anymore. Ankle replacement can really change someone's life. Patients have tremendous amount of pain. They have a lot of limitation. And in many cases, they've been dealing with it for many years. Um, it's a procedure that takes pain away, and it's remarkable in that ability. Uh, at the same time, it allows patients to return to the activities that they love doing, um, particularly patients who are active. They like walking, hiking, walking on the beach, but patients really have a, a, a tremendous ability to return to their quality of life. But here you can see, not only did I have to make the cut to put the implant in on the tibia yeah. and the talus, these two anchors are for your ligaments on the outside. Okay. Well, I have a good friend of mine who were out in the woods and we had gotten pretty far out there and I had my walking stick and she didn't and she was fading. I said, well, here, take my walking stick. I don't really need it. And that was um, remarkable to me because I haven't been in the woods without a walking stick in probably five years. So for me to be able to give her the walking stick and let her use it was pretty remarkable.